I know, I'm an idiot. When I marked out the wall last week, I did so with the thought in mind that I needed to allow for the thickness of the new track bed. And guess what I forgot to do? There is a way around it. Instead of just plonking this whole bit on top of the mounts, I will cut that much off the bottom of each leg and then I'll just screw that end to the mounts on the wall. Just to add to my pain, my rain cover was completely ineffective. Things got wet, but I got on with what I was doing and, you know, cut the leg. It took a lot longer than it looks. Really, it did. Ow! And then I had to screw the thing onto the wall. That was fun. Not. Anyway, it, it got wetter, so I had to kind of dry it with a heat gun. And I thought the best way to weatherproof the thing was to put roof felt on it, so that's what I did. Oh, and I hurt my thumb. Here's a nice montage. Look, I'm painting. Splat. Staple gunning. Oh, and did you know that garden shears cut roof felt really well? These back bits I couldn't get into with the stapler, so I used drawing pins. And there we have it. That's much better, isn't it?